Bayesian Probability, Wikipedia Article Audio Bayesian probability is an interpretation of the concept of probability, in which, instead of frequency or propensity of some phenomenon, probability is interpreted as reasonable expectation representing a state of knowledge or as quantification of a personal belief. The Bayesian interpretation of probability can be seen as an extension of propositional logic that enables reasoning with hypotheses, i.e., the propositions whose truth or falsity is uncertain. In the Bayesian view, a probability is assigned to a hypothesis, whereas under frequentist inference, a hypothesis is typically tested without being assigned a probability. Bayesian Methodology Objective and Subjective Bayesian Probabilities Bayesian probability belongs to the category of evidential probabilities, to evaluate the probability of a hypothesis, the Bayesian probabilist specifies some prior probability, which is then updated to a posterior probability in the light of new, relevant data. The Bayesian interpretation provides a standard set of procedures and formulae to perform this calculation. The term Bayesian derives from the 18th century mathematician and theologian Thomas Bayes, who provided the first mathematical treatment of a non-trivial problem of statistical data analysis, now known as the Bayesian inference. Mathematician Pierre-Simon Laplace pioneered and popularized what is now called Bayesian probability. Broadly speaking, there are two views on Bayesian probability that interpret the probability concept in different ways. According to the objectivist view, probability is a reasonable expectation that represents the state of knowledge, can be interpreted as an extension of logic, and its rules can be justified by Cox's theorem. According to the subjectivist view, probability quantifies a personal belief and its rules can be justified by requirements of rationality and coherence following from the Dutch book argument or from the decision theory and affinities theorem. Bayesian methods are characterized by concepts and procedures as follows. Broadly speaking, there are two interpretations on Bayesian probability. For objectivists, interpreting probability as extension of logic, Probability quantifies the reasonable expectation everyone sharing the same knowledge should share in accordance with the rules of Bayesian statistics, which can be justified by Cox's theorem. For subjectivists, probability corresponds to a personal belief. Rationality and coherence allow for substantial variation within the constraints they pose. The constraints are justified by the Dutch book argument or by the decision theory and affinities theorem. The objective and subjective variants of Bayesian probability differ mainly in their interpretation and construction of the prior probability. History The term Bayesian refers to Thomas Bayes who proved a special case of what is now called Bayes' theorem in a paper titled An Essay Towards Solving a Problem in the Doctrine of Chances. In that special case, the prior and posterior distributions were beta distributions and the data came from Bernoulli trials. It was Pierre-Simon Laplace who introduced a general version of the theorem and used it to approach problems in celestial mechanics, medical statistics, reliability, and jurisprudence. Early Bayesian inference, which used uniform priors following Laplace's principle of insufficient reason, was called inverse probability. After the 1920s, Inverse probability was largely supplanted by a collection of methods that came to be called frequentist statistics. In the 20th century, the ideas of Laplace developed in two directions, giving rise to objective and subjective currents in Bayesian practice. 
Harold Jeffrey's theory of probability played an important role in the revival of the Bayesian view of probability, followed by works by Abraham Wald and Leonard J. Savage. The adjective Bayesian itself dates to the 1950s, the derived Bayesianism, Neo-Bayesianism is of 1960s coinage. In the objectivist stream, the statistical analysis depends on only the model assumed and the data analyzed. No subjective decisions need to be involved. In contrast, subjectivist statisticians deny the possibility of fully objective analysis for the general case. Justification of Bayesian Probabilities in the 1980s there was a dramatic growth in research and applications of Bayesian methods, mostly attributed to the discovery of Markov chain Monte Carlo methods and the consequent removal of many of the computational problems, and to an increasing interest in non-standard, complex applications. While frequentist statistics remain strong, Bayesian methods are widely accepted and used, e.g., in the field of machine learning. The use of Bayesian probabilities as the basis of Bayesian inference has been supported by several arguments, such as Cox axioms, the Dutch book argument, arguments based on decision theory and affinities theorem. Richard T. Cox showed that Bayesian updating follows from several axioms including two functional equations and a hypothesis of differentiability. The assumption of differentiability or even continuity is controversial, Halpern found a counterexample based on his observation that the Boolean algebra of statements may be finite. Other axiomatizations have been suggested by various authors with the purpose of making the theory more rigorous. Axiomatic Approach the Dutch book argument was proposed by Definity, it is based on betting. A Dutch book is made when a clever gambler places a set of bets that guarantee a profit, no matter what the outcome of the bets. If a bookmaker follows the rules of the Bayesian calculus in the construction of his odds, a Dutch book cannot be made. Dutch book approach However, Ian Hacking noted that traditional Dutch book arguments did not specify Bayesian updating, they left open the possibility that non-Bayesian updating rules could avoid Dutch books. For example, Hacking writes and neither the Dutch book argument, nor any other in the personalist arsenal of proofs of the probability axioms, entails the dynamic assumption. Not one entails Bayesianism. So the personalist requires the dynamic assumption to be Bayesian. It is true that in consistency a personalist could abandon the Bayesian model of learning from experience. Salt could lose its savor. Decision theory approach In fact, there are non-Bayesian updating rules that also avoid Dutch books following the publication of Richard C. Jeffrey's rule which is itself regarded as Bayesian. The additional hypotheses sufficient to specify Bayesian updating are substantial and not universally seen as satisfactory. A decision-theoretic justification of the use of Bayesian inference was given by Abraham Wald, who proved that every admissible statistical procedure is either a Bayesian procedure or a limit of Bayesian procedures. Conversely, every Bayesian procedure is admissible. Personal Probabilities and Objective Methods for Constructing Priors Following the work on expected utility theory of Ramsey and von Neumann, decision theorists have accounted for rational behavior using a probability distribution for the agent. Johann Pfanzigl completed the theory of games and economic behavior by providing an axiomatization of subjective probability and utility, a task left uncompleted by von Neumann and Oskar Morgenstern, their original theory supposed that all the agents had the same probability distribution, as a convenience. 
Fanzigl's axiomatization was endorsed by Oscar Morgenstern, von Neumann and I have anticipated the question whether probabilities might, perhaps more typically, be subjective and have stated specifically that in the latter case axioms could be found from which could derive the desired numerical utility together with a number for the probabilities. We did not carry this out, it was demonstrated by Pfanzigl, with all the necessary rigor. Ramsey and Savage noted that the individual agent's probability distribution could be objectively studied in experiments. The role of judgment and disagreement in science has been recognized since Aristotle and even more clearly with Francis Bacon. The objectivity of science lies not in the psychology of individual scientists, but in the process of science and especially in statistical methods, as noted by C.S. Pierce. Recall that the objective methods for falsifying propositions about personal probabilities have been used for a half century, as noted previously. Procedures for testing hypotheses about probabilities are due to Ramsey and Definity. Both Bruno Definity and Frank P. Ramsey acknowledge their debts to pragmatic philosophy, particularly to Charles S. Pierce. The Ramsey test for evaluating probability distributions is implementable in theory, and has kept experimental psychologists occupied for a half century. This work demonstrates that Bayesian probability propositions can be falsified, and so meet an empirical criterion of Charles S. Pierce, whose work inspired Ramsey. Modern work on the experimental evaluation of personal probabilities uses the randomization, blinding, and Boolean decision procedures of the Pierce-Jastrow experiment. Since individuals act according to different probability judgments, these agents' probabilities are personal. Personal probabilities are problematic for science and for some applications where decision makers lack the knowledge or time to specify an informed probability distribution. To meet the needs of science and of human limitations, Bayesian statisticians have developed objective methods for specifying prior probabilities. Indeed, some Bayesians have argued the prior state of knowledge defines the prior probability distribution for regular statistical problems, cf. well-posed problems. Finding the right method for constructing such objective priors has been the quest of statistical theorists from Laplace to John Maynard Keynes, Harold Jeffries, and Edwin Thompson Jaynes. These theorists and their successors have suggested several methods for constructing objective priors. Each of these methods contributes useful priors for regular one-parameter problems, and each prior can handle some challenging statistical models. Each of these methods has been useful in Bayesian practice. Indeed, Methods for constructing objective priors have been developed by avowed subjective Bayesians like James Berger and José Miguel Bernardo, simply because such priors are needed for Bayesian practice, particularly in science. The quest for the universal method for constructing priors continues to attract statistical theorists. The use of random variables, or more generally unknown quantities, to model all sources of uncertainty in statistical models including uncertainty resulting from lack of information, the need to determine the prior probability distribution taking into account the available information, the sequential use of Bayes' formula, when more data become available, calculate the posterior distribution using Bayes' formula, subsequently, the posterior distribution becomes the next prior, while for the frequentist a hypothesis is a proposition, so that the frequentist probability of a hypothesis is either zero or one, in Bayesian statistics the probability that can be assigned to a hypothesis can also be in a range from zero to one if the truth value is uncertain. Thus, 
the Beixian statistician needs either to use informed priors or to choose among the competing methods for constructing objective priors. Maximum Entropy, Transformation Group Analysis, Reference Analysis Bibliography